Well, I'm a little bit melancholy because I have just arrived at my very last camp here in Idaho for a while. And yeah, it's been such an incredible time here. Every camp that I've been at has been beautiful. It's going to be very tough for me to leave. However, I will be moving on to another state and I will be starting off my adventures there with a bang. <laughs> Trust me, you do not want to miss it. It's absolutely beautiful here. The temperatures have cooled off quite a bit. It's been really hot, but today it's in the, about the mid 70s, a nice cool breeze. I'm here right along this creek, another creek, and it's spectacular. It's going to be a fun last camp. I have more adventures planned just to, you know, make sure that I leave Idaho with a bang. So I'm excited uh, for my couple days here before moving on. It's gonna be awesome. The Idaho sky decided to put on a show for my big send-off, displaying the best sunset I had seen since I arrived. quick word about the sponsor of today's video, Athletic Greens. Hello there. I'm super excited because I'm currently packing my bags for a multi-day trip into the backcountry. And one thing that will definitely be making its way into my pack are my AG1 travel packets. I will have one for each morning and I will definitely need them to start my day, making sure that I have all my vitamins and minerals to climb those mountains and hike those long miles. I love AG1 travel packs. I can pop them in my purse or my backpack and get my nutrition anywhere and everywhere. Ingredients include adaptogens and antioxidants. Adaptogens are an amazing class of herbs that respond to influences like stress and can aid in supporting better sleep quality and lowering everyday physical and mental fatigue. You definitely don't need to be an athlete or climb mountains to reap the benefits of AG1. AG1 supports your energy, focus, gut health, digestion, and immune system without the need to take multiple products or pills. Energy supporting ingredients include a natural form of B12, never synthetic, biotin, bioavailable folate, and magnesium. So what are you waiting for? Go to the link in the description now to get a year's supply of vitamin D3, K2, and five travel packs for free with your first purchase. Thank you once again to Athletic Greens for sponsoring this video. Now back to the show.
Good morning. It's another gorgeous morning here in Idaho. I will be getting on the road tomorrow, so it's really my last full morning to just enjoy and relax and soak it all in. This is a place that I've definitely uh, not had a huge desire to move on. A lot of times when I go to locations and I spend a bit of time there, I get antsy and I'm ready to move on, but here, it's not so much. <laughs> I've absolutely loved it here. However, I do have plans in another state that I need to get to. Uh, lots of times I like to keep it fluid so that I don't have to be anywhere by any certain time, but I'm excited about this and I do need to be at another location by a certain date. Today's going to be an awesome day. I'm going to... Uh, probably go out on a couple of adventures and maybe um, do some hiking and then maybe something kind of special. But first I'm going to go ahead and make some breakfast and then uh, yeah, get the day started. On the menu this morning is a breakfast burrito with these ingredients. Got my sausage cooking up with some spinach leaves. I'm gonna heat up this sun-dried tomato and basil tortilla right over the flame. The clouds had rolled in, but no rain was expected. I decided to start my first adventure of the day on the water at Pettit Lake. I picked up a small, inflatable $90 kayak from Amazon and today is my first day out on water with it. this little cove because the wind is starting to pick up a bit. It's supposed to blow up to 10 miles per hour today, but on the water that makes quite a bit of difference. So it's much calmer here, which is nice. One of the things I've absolutely loved about my time in Idaho is all the beautiful wildflowers.
The skies began clearing, so I decided to head up on the road behind camp for a hike. I was going to pack in everything I could before it was time to go. I had seen some photos of this lake online and honestly, they didn't do it justice. This is 4th of July Lake. It sits at about 9,400 feet in elevation. And what a beautiful afternoon to come up here. Since today was a very active day and busy. I'm going to make something easy and this is not low cal so it's a good thing I got a lot of exercise in. Four cheese or five cheese ravioli, four cheese alfredo and some freshly grated parmigiano reggiano. Okay we got the pasta in and the alfredo going. It won't be long. 
Well, sadly, my time here in Idaho is coming to an end. It's been almost a month now, and I have loved every single minute of it. I hope that you've enjoyed spending this time here with me. It has definitely made its way into my top favorite states, and it's made its way into my heart. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. Make sure you stay tuned for the next adventure in the next state, which is going to be really exciting. And I appreciate you all being with me here in Idaho. Love you all, and I'll see you next Sunday. See you soon. Bye-bye.